Grand Seiko's most groundbreaking technical caliber, and one that's totally unique to them, is spring drive. When I visited Grand Seiko in Japan last year, I had the opportunity to get a closer look at spring drive and learn how it works. And one explanation that I heard over and over again from Grand Seiko's engineers sums up the movement perfectly. As they explain it, spring drive combines the best in mechanical watchmaking and the best of quartz timekeeping to create a state-of-the-art caliber that lacks the weaknesses inherent to both of these movements. The result is a watch with quartz-like accuracy of plus or minus one second a day, coupled with the unlimited energy potential of a mechanical watch powered by mainspring. Let's start with the power source. Like a mechanical movement, spring drive has a mainspring as its power source, not a battery. And just like a mechanical movement, this mainspring is wound up by either a rotor or manually by hand through the crown. This mainspring drives a standard gear train, just like the sort you'd see in a mechanical watch. But instead of a traditional escapement, at the end of that gear train, Grand Seiko uses a proprietary piece of tech called a tri-synchro regulator, which harnesses mechanical, electromagnetic, and electrical energy to produce an accurate timekeeper. Here's how the tri-synchro regulator works. At the end of the gear train is a small disc called the glide wheel. With the help of two electromagnets, the glide wheel slows down the release of energy from the mainspring without friction. It doesn't start and stop in the way a traditional mechanical escapement does, and because it's constantly turning, you get a second hand that advances in a smooth, continuous motion, a signature trait of spring drive watches. But the rate at which that energy is released still needs to be regulated, so how does the tri synchro regulator do that? The glide wheel creates an electrical current, and this current runs through and activates an integrated circuit and a quartz oscillator. The frequency produced by a quartz oscillator functions as a reference signal for the integrated circuit, which compares that signal to the revolution speed of the glide wheel. This is where the regulation happens. If it senses that the glide wheel is running too fast, the integrated circuit applies a brake to the wheel, slowing it down. Think of the integrated circuit as a sort of on-off switch for the electromagnetic brake. Now regulated, the energy being put out by the mainspring is translated into accurate timekeeping, achieving incredible accuracy of plus or minus one second a day. And because the integrated circuit consumes very little power, about 1 300 millionth of your typical LED light bulb, spring drive is able to maintain a power reserve of 72 hours. Performance aside, spring drive movements are extremely beautiful and a joy to look at. And because spring drive movements feature a full catalog of high-end finishing, among them striping, perlage, polished bevels throughout, and jewels, you'd be forgiven for thinking this was a traditional mechanical caliber on appearances alone. Spring drive watches are really unlike anything else you'll find in the market, and with our combination of aesthetics, performance, and ingenuity, Grand Seiko spring drive-powered watches are truly worthy of the moniker Grand.